Hello everybody, I am Just Lance and I would like to welcome you all back for another video. Anyways, as you can see from the title, Flash Boredom would call this video a non-shaving shaving video. <laughs> Anyways, um, dang. Uh, I know you got really good reasons, Flash, but man, you made some good videos. Anyways, so anyhow, I'm going to be showing you guys some new stuff to the den, and I'm also going to be doing uh, quite a few shout-outs here. I figured um, I wouldn't do the shout-outs in the shave video, because there's quite a number of them. Um, I had a recent surge, as a number of YouTubers did in the past few days. One moment. But like I said, I had a bit of a surge. So we're going to go ahead and give the shout. So let's get those out of the way. As you can see, I'm wearing my earbuds because I've got all the names on my handy dandy little Victor Reader here by Humanware. And the new subscribers are Daniel Diachenko, Brian the Floridian. The entire Chalmers family, um, pretty much, they're all subscribed, which is John Shaves 101, the DC Shaves, the EC Shaves, the Shaving Chick, and Shave Girl. Rich Hansen of Shaving with Rich, Scott Arthur Leslie, J.R. Gonzalez, Christopher Williams, Lyle Nevert, Roger Helms, John Anderson, The Dude of Shaving, Big Blue Shaving, Latherwolf85, which has when I looked last time in his channel, he had less than 50 subscribers. Um, so, you know, check him out. If you like him, give him a sub. Enrico Suave. Spider Shaves for TSC. And some of the people I mentioned... I may have mentioned them twice because um, I'm not sure uh, who as far as uh, them go if they have a YouTube channel or not so um, but the YouTube channels I did mention um, if you want to see who I follow you can go on my um, on the tab for channels see what channels I follow and the channels I just mentioned they're on there and quite a few more anyways so let's move on to the products the first two products come from Phoenix shaving uh, not this last drop that Lancaster Razorworks did for black sheep shaving towels which once again struck out wasn't quick enough I mean they go incredibly fast but the time before, I was like, eh, well, you know what? I'll get a couple of brushes from Phoenix Shaving. And the two I got, first one I'll show you. have seen it on Ken Surf's videos. Um, he pretty much got it right after it was released. I believe he picked it up at one of the Big Shave West. And it is this one. This is the Solar Flare with the 24 millimeter white Nexus knot. As you can see, it's got this octagon shape handle. It's in kind of a butterscotch color. The uh, design is based off, an, uh, off of a vintage brush called the Erskine 250. The second one is the final installment in his retro brush line, which has the Atomic Rocket, the Starcraft, the Green Ray, the Solar Flare, which I just showed you, and this one. This is the Peregrino which is Spanish for Pilgrim. It has a 24 millimeter Roswell gray knot, the same knot that's in the Starcraft. Um, the handle is based off of an EverReady 500E. 
it's got the octagon shape handle comes in goes out to this little ridge and then the ball that the the knot goes down into is kind of squished looks kind of feels like it looks like it's squished down very cool brush so i've used the peregrino have not used the solar flare yet now the next product i'm going to show you is a razor because one's a razor one's a brush and i'll save the brush for last because it is vintage and it is one i thought i'd never have not just the brush but the name anyways i'm a little disappointed with the packaging which is this um I don't have any of this manufacturer's uh, products in my den, so I'm looking forward to adding it. It was on sale. It's normally a $125 razor. Oops, don't want to drop it. And salt stainless steel. And it's packaged well. It's sealed well, I'll say. Hang on, guys. But it's a 90, a hundred and eighty. Normally a hundred and twenty-five. Let me grab my knife here. Normally a hundred and twenty-five dollar razor, but it was on sale for ninety dollars. Okay. Working it, guys. I really am. Yeah, there we go. Got it gone. Comes in a padded envelope. And comes packaged like this. Not a box. Comes in an envelope. So... Let's open her up and see what we got here. The envelope is padded as well. There's the, oh, it comes with a free pack of blades. Not sure what those blades are. Comes with a card. Oh, that's a sweet handle. And the handle comes wrapped like this. I think I mentioned these are, this is the same company that makes the icon or the shade craft, just blew it. Oh wow, that's an awesome handle right there. Look at that, guys. Kind of looks like a torpedo. That's sweet. Razor head comes wrapped in plastic and taped off. Anyways, guys, you might have noticed a little bit of editing. It was taking me a bit to get into the razor, so I just went ahead and edited it out. But there's the head. Let me go ahead and oops. It goes together. It's got little tabs on the inside of the head, little corner tabs like an old tech, and a uh, little these little tabs here to go in the blade and then it drops down um, very very much like the um, timeless does if you're familiar with that razor threads are smooth but look at that guys this is the icon b2 open comb deluxe um, stainless steel safety razor from Icon. Um, it's got the DLC coating on it. So, you know, it's my first razor with the DLC coating. That's a really, really awesome razor. 
I also have some shaving towels from the Hand of Shaving coming. They're just simple cotton towels, shave towels, but they measure 16 by 24. I'll show you those in a shave when I get them. And I also got from Maggots Razors, they're like 99 cents for 10 of them. I ordered uh, three packs, which would give me 30 of them. And they're the little nylon washers that go over the threaded posts, like you see Michael Freeberg, Chris Bailey, I believe. Kevy Shaves does it. Um, you know, so I got a pack of those coming. But yeah, look at that. It's a longer handle. Really just outstanding knurling on here. Outstanding knurling. Oh yeah, it, this is just, this might have some of the best knurling I've ever seen on a razor. Seriously, guys. I don't know if that's the Icon logo at the bottom, but from what I understand, their logo has a skull in it. I'm not sure if it's got the, um, what do you call it? The uh, Icon across the top. But yeah, look at that. That's just, that's nice. That is really, really nice. I went to order the Game Changer, but they were out of stock. Um, the 84 head, the 84, .84 razors. They were out of stock, so I said, no, oh, heck with that, look. And I thought, you know what? I don't have an icon. So I went and checked their site out and uh, absolutely thrilled with having that razor. So, let's go ahead and let's get to the box. It comes from VintageBlades.com over there on the Etsy store. And the Icon Razors, you can get those through Maggots Razors. Um... No, the razor is normally 125 but I got it for 85 5 bucks for shipping and handling. Oops, hang on. Knocked off the film, my peregrino. But when I saw this, this item, I just absolutely had to have it. I'm not sure what that is. Let's see. Probably an invoice or something. I'll let you guys know um, in the shave when I do it. But yeah, the icon it came with a pack of five blades. Not sure what ones. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's wrapped in tissue. It was wrapped in bubble wrap and it's wrapped in ti Ooh. Oh. That's nice. That is very, very nice. Oh. This guy's is a near mint boots rooney bb24 best badger shaving brush this brush was made it's made out of a catalan plastic the handle pretty solid handle too that feels nice catalan plastic which is a photosynthesis uh, uh, brush or uh, plastic that's sensitive to ultraviolet light and it turned this um, butterscotch color over time because uh, when they first pour the plastic it's white but this yeah this just turned this butterscotch color over it so it's a BB 24 best badger Catalan butterscotch brush um, like I said best best badger near mint Yeah, the knot smells not bad. It don't smell mildewy, but I'll go ahead and use my PAA soap. And like I said, this brush was, was made for Brooks Brothers over there in the UK, originally by Rooney. I never thought I'd have a Rooney brush because they are very expensive. 
and I figured if I did, I need to save up for it. Now, I this am one. CDB. Straits number 12. Take picture. Button. Sorry, guys. I forgot to put my uh, phone on airplane mode. But, yeah. So, this is very nice. This is very nice. I look very forward to using it. Um, and I'll use it in the next shave. Anyways, so that's the unboxing. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, I'm looking very, very forward to using this brush, this razor, and we'll do that in the next video. Anyways, y'all take it easy. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Thank you to all my longtime subscribers. Welcome to anybody who is relatively new as a subscriber. <coughs> Pardon me. I want you to all take it easy, stay safe, and I'll see all of you on the flip side of the blade. Bye-bye now.